In 2014, five school teams in Granada, Nicaragua were trained in the Earth Partnership Schoolyard Habitat Curriculum. Each school team included the school principals, a teacher, a parent, and a student. The teams learned to involve students with plant species, insects, biological diversity, and water stewardship. They followed the raindrop from the schoolyard to Lake Nicaragua, tracing the pathway of stormwater through the streets, drainage ditches, and streams to the place where these waterways enter the lake. The school teams were appalled. One school director observed that the contamination of the lake is a mortal sin. They continued their investigation by observing macroinvertebrates, bioindicators of water quality on the lake shore. They learned that na native plantings on the schoolyard not only provide beautification, but also can improve water quality by filtering stormwater before it flows into the arroyo and eventually into the lake. In Barrio Pio Doce, in the town of Nandasmo, village leaders responded to the challenge and agreed to become environmental educators for their children. For four days, elders and young adults worked together with elementary children and high school students to become educational leaders for their peers. School gardens can also provide food and skills for self-sufficiency, water stewardship, and conservation in the face of climate change. Now these school teams are planning projects to bring alive ecological restoration and water stewardship practices on their schoolyards and in their communities. In 2015, Nicaraguan environmental organizations and University of Wisconsin students will help. The schools and community teams need funds for materials, tools, supplies, and technical assistance to continue to implement their learning and to teach others. Will you help? Gracias. Adiós. Adiós.